One of the most iconic pieces of medical equipment has to be the stethoscope. But thanks to a new device, you may not see those used in the future. After trying the device, Dr. David Bellow can't imagine a future with a stethoscope. The doctor recently saw a patient who tried to describe a scary heart fluttering sound. And as he listened to them try to describe what happened, Bellow was frustrated by what they said. I have that sound for you. I would like to share that sound with you. They couldn't do it. So now we have a way to do it. That is thanks to HeartBuds. This device is used with a smartphone app to detect, record, store, and share sounds. Researchers at Orlando Health put it to the test to see how it would compare to the traditional 200-year-old stethoscope. We examined four different stethoscope models, um, and we, uh, we used them on 50 different patients, listening to their heart sounds, their lung sounds, their abdominal sounds, and also uh, their vessels in their neck. Researchers found heart buds picked up sounds just as well as the top stethoscopes on the market, and better than disposable models. In fact, compared to heart buds, disposable stethoscopes missed 43% of heart murmurs and up to 75% of corroded artery blockage. Even more importantly, the opportunity for bacteria to nest in the earpieces of stethoscopes is eliminated. So with this electronic stethoscope that no longer has this portion, there'll be no more transmitting this stuff between the patients. It also allows patients with chronic diseases like heart failure to manage their own condition from home. They can now record their own sounds and send the file to their doctor. And within a few minutes, have it listened to, analyzed, and have a report back from their doctor's office. That's exciting. That's the future of medicine. On top of that, athletes can use heart buds to monitor their bodies and pregnant women can use them to record sounds of their babies in the womb to share with friends and family. Reporting for ABC 10 and the CW5, I'm Sarah Mack.